The Paralympic team was treated to a festive homecoming in Auckland this morning. About a hundred proud fans and family gathered outside the North Shore's AU2 Millennium to check to cheer the athletes who won a total of 21 medals in Rio, of course. Our reporter, Eva Corlett, was there. Ladies and gentlemen, let us please welcome the 2016 New Zealand Paralympic team. Fans sat on blue tarps waving flags, wearing crowns and flaunting decorated signs while eagerly awaiting their favourite athletes to take the stage. One group of dedicated young fans took the day off school to support the team. We're here to support the Paralympians. I love your gold hair. How did you do that? Um, we um, got some hair, gold hairspray. And who are you guys here to support? Tupo! Hi. The trio say they were backing swimmer Tupo Neufi because they shared a special bond. Me and Naya and Tupo have had the same therapist, Jane Hamer, and she um, put us on swimming. So without Jane, we wouldn't be even like interested in doing sports. So it's really, I'm really happy to see that. The athletes were called into the celebration by their individual sport groups before a select few competitors were interviewed on stage. Crowd favourite Liam Malone told MC Peter Williams he will be heading back to the books to finish his degree this year. Swimming star Sophie Pascoe said she would be focusing on life outside of the pool, but the Commonwealth Games are on the horizon. Gold-winning long jumper Anna Grimaldi won the first medal for the team. She told RNZ News she had only expected to come sixth. I was darting between the two screens. One showed your distance, one showed the standings, and I was like looking around, and I couldn't like kind of get it together. And then I saw the distance, and I was just celebrating how big it was. I was like, oh my god, massive PB! And then I saw Raylene crying on the sideline, and my family like losing it, and it was just awesome. And I guess that overwhelmed me right then. I just started bawling my eyes out. Silver medalist and javelin and official flag bearer Holly Robinson says the support has been outstanding. It's an amazing feeling to know that we're a small country but we've got a huge support team across, across the country and it was really cool, it was really cool being away and, and getting all those messages and hearing from all those people, it, it's amazing and I can't thank New Zealand enough for the support that they've given us and you know the people that have supported me personally as well. The New Zealand team's haul of nine gold, five silver and seven bronze medals ranked them in first place for medals per capita. The Paralympic chef de mission Ben Lucas says Rio put on a stunning show and he is immensely proud of the team. He says the team's nine golds should help garner more funding for the Paralympics in the future. Getting nine golds, I think that uh, this is a good opportunity for us to get some more